professional traders need professional tools, CQG's DOM Trader offers traders the perfect order routing interface, which combines ease of use with wide ranging functionality. Welcome to an overview of the CQG DOM Trader features tutorial. This video walks you through the features and functionality of the CQG DOM Trader. To start, when the DOM Trader is in the active window in your CQG page, this set of toolbar buttons appears. Let's review each toolbar button. Clicking Setup takes you to this drop-down menu where you can see the trading preferences, change the password, as well as the connection preference. Click Log On to enter your username and password and log on to the CQG Gateway. Click Log Off to close the connection to the gateway. Click Center to center the best bid and ask to the middle of the price ladder of the DOM trader. Click Fill Report to open the Fill Report. Click Order Position to open the Orders and Positions display. Clicking Cancel cancels all working orders. Now, let's review the DOM Trader. Starting from the top of the DOM Trader, we'll work our way down. Roll the mouse over the title bar to see the login status and the current open trade equity and including closed profits and losses for the day of your position. The symbol tabs are color-coded. A green colored tab means a long position. A red colored tab means a short position. A black colored tab means a working order with no position. The DOM trader displays the current position. The open trade equity includes the closed profits and losses for the day for the selected symbol. If there is no position for this account, the display states no position. Right-click the position details to reverse or liquidate the position. This field is optional. To the left of the current position detail is the number of working buy orders. On the right of the OTE is the number of working sell orders. The S button is used to toggle the price ladder to display all working orders or just orders that are part of a spread order. If the button is colored orange, then the display spread orders is on. The price ladder displays both working orders that are legs of a spread for that symbol and any other orders. If the button is gray, then orders that are part of a spread are not displayed. Choose from this menu to set your order duration options. Day orders, GTC or good till canceled, FAK or fill and kill, FOK or fill or kill, and iceberg orders. Select from this menu when you want to play stop, stop limit, DOM triggered stop or DOM triggered stop limit orders. Stop is the default. CQG offers DOM triggered stop orders as part of its suite of smart orders. These orders must be enabled by CQG and by you in Smart Orders Trading Preferences. You can change the default to Limit and Stop Order Preferences. Next, choose to trade using Trailing Limits or Trailing Stop Orders from this menu. These orders also must be enabled by CQG and by you in Smart Orders Trading Preferences. Occasionally, a trade may be placed outside of the CQG gateway, such as a phone order to the pit. Selecting this icon enables you to manually enter fills for those trades that did not occur through CQG 
to be reconciled against your account statement. All electronic and PIT contract symbols can be entered. The Special Orders menu provides options for Order Cancels Order, Bracket, Order Types. This concludes Part 1 of an overview of the CQG DOM Trader features. Thank you.